guys my name is Everledger and today I am back with another Pixel Strike 3D video so in today's video it's going to be it's probably gonna be a little bit shorter than most of them most generally I try to get them 10 minutes or longer but this one's probably gonna be less just because I'm basically just covering some update information on a future Pixel Strike 3D update kind of but it's not exactly a regular update um I'll get more into that in just a minute real quick uh, I know most of my Pixel Gun 3D viewers already know about this, so if you are a Pixel Strike 3D uh, viewer, first things first, make sure you guys check out my Discord server, and that is linked down below. Uh, if you guys are interested in merch, go ahead and check that out down below as well. Uh, everything is 10% off right now. If you use code FREVER, I'll put that on screen right when I just said that. Um, you get 10% off and all the stuff is probably going to be gone in a week or two when I get new stuff out So i uh, take advantage of that 10% off while you can and also check out my social medias as well So with that being said, let's just go ahead and hop right into this um this little update coverage thing So uh, with that being said, let's just go ahead and get into it So all information from this is coming directly from uh, Volcron forever Which is the discord user of one of the developers on uh, well, discord and it's coming directly from their Discord server, which if you're not in that, you should probably go and find a link to join that as well, because uh, it's going to be the quickest way to get your update information and stuff like that, and it's just all, it's really convenient, you can talk to other people. Anyways, I'm getting carried away. So, Pixel, this is what they tweeted out right here, or posted, I'll have it, I'll put it on screen so you guys can read along. It says, Pixel Strike 3D is coming to Steam in May 2020, and then they left the link for that as well, so you guys can go check that out. So basically, if you don't know what Steam is, it's basically Steam Engine, it's a software where you can get on your computer, uh, PC, Windows, Mac, Linux, whatever you want, and you can actually uh, you get games from there. And Pixel Strike 3D is coming to that. So Pixel Strike 3D is coming to PC, which is pretty interesting. Um, so real quick, I'm going to go ahead and say this right now. Um, as of right now, on the Steam page, I already went to it, they only have it for uh, uh, Windows users. They don't have it available for Mac users or Linux users, so I cannot use it because I'm a Linux user. Um, and uh, if you are a Mac user, you have a MacBook, Mac and I don't know the Mac desktop, what other crap that thing's called. You cannot get this as of right now. I'm hoping they expand that in the future so that uh, Windows, Mac, and Linux users can all play together. So that's just a little uh, disclosure right there. So here are some frequently asked questions that they posted right here. Will PC players be able to play with mobile players? And they said no. The games. The games will be entirely separately. Everything, including user IDs and clans, will be separate. So everything that you have on your phone right now on Pixel Strike 3D, if you do choose to get it on PC from Steam, um, none of that will carry over. It's going to be completely different. It's going to be a completely different game. So basically, you're going to have your mobile device stuff, and then you're going to have your PC device stuff. It's all going to be separate. Nothing will be connected, which is actually very good because it keeps it balanced. Because um, if you master on keyboard and mouse playing on PC, uh, you're going to have major advantages over the people on mobile, so it's just a good, smart thing to do to keep the game balanced like that. Next thing is, will the game be free to play? Yes, it'll be free to play just like the mobile version, so basically, only thing you have to pay for is cases, uh, and then you have like weapon skins, all the cosmetic items and stuff like that. Uh, and if you want to buy weapons early before like, you have to actually get to the level to unlock them, you guys can buy that as well. So it's going to be completely free to play, just like the real game, which is very, very good. Um, which, I mean, they could have easily made it to have a little bit extra features to make you pay some more. But I'm actually very happy that they're not doing that, because uh, most developers tend to do that. And I'm so happy that Volcron is not doing that in this case. The next thing is, will there be a beta? Uh, we plan to hold a private beta leading up to the release. We will have a sign up for Steam keys when that gets closer. So make sure you, if you're not already, go and join their Discord server. So you guys can actually, uh, if you're interested, you guys can try to get onto the beta testing list. So you guys can get uh, early access to this game before everybody else gets it, uh, which will be uh, pretty interesting for you. If you're a content creator, you'll probably want to do that as well if you are planning on making videos on uh, Pixel Strike 3D for PC. I'm probably going to stick with the mobile though because um, 
it's more convenient for me because it's everything's right there on my phone and it's easier to record and all that good stuff. But anyways, next question is, will the game be exactly the same as the mobile version? And they said it will be exactly the same except for some balancing changes and extra settings for PC related things. So what I'm assuming from there is uh, with the extra settings, probably going to have uh, better frame rate options, better graphics options, stuff like that. Uh, maybe extra shaders and stuff like that. Uh, just simple basic stuff that you generally see on PC games and you do not see on mobile games um, to make it like enhance the graphics basically. Balancing changes, I'm not entirely sure what they mean by that, but hopefully uh, they know what they're doing. I'm assuming they do because Volcron, uh, these last few updates have been very, very good with uh, Pixel Strike from what I've seen. So uh, I, I'm pretty sure I'm confident they know what they're doing. One thing that I really hope they do, and they could easily do this, um, but not the same exact way. I hope they do it like uh, Pixel Gun 3D had Pixel Gun World a long time ago. I'm hoping, they said it's going to be exactly the same, but I'm hoping maybe in future updates, uh, the, the uh, PC version will either get stuff a little bit earlier or get uh, new, more like bigger maps and stuff like that because it's on PC, it can run a lot more stuff more smoothly. Uh, bigger files and stuff like that. It's more capable of running things uh, more efficiently. So I'm hoping they add some uh, more device heavy uh, uh, maps and stuff into the game and just features. I think it'd be really interesting to do. Um, but from what it seems like, they don't. I don't know if they have plans to do it in the future, but as of right now, they plan on keeping it basically the same exact game as Pixel Strike 3D on mobile. So um, that's interesting right there. But I do hope to see some things different so that basically if you're playing on PC, you're going to be getting some type of... Um, uh, what's it called exclusives that the mobile players don't get and then same thing with the other way around the mobile players will get some type of exclusives that the PC users won't get uh, I think it's just really smart to do it that way and uh, I hope to see that happen if Volcron's watching this uh, Maybe think about that, you know, just think about it. Yeah So anyways guys, that's really all they've uh, said right now about that so uh, if you guys do want to check that out, uh, I have all the screenshots on screen so you guys can see that. Um, but uh, yeah, if, you always do, if you're interested, I will have a link to, I'll try to remember to put a link to the Steam page down below so you guys can check that out uh, and put it on your wish list already if you're interested. So uh, with that being said, I hope you guys did enjoy this video. I'm just trying to cover some updates. If there is any more information on any Pixel Strike 3D updates, uh, if it's enough information, I'll try to do a video on that. So look forward to that as well. If you guys did enjoy it, make sure you guys leave a like. If you want to see more content and you're new, subscribe and turn on the bell notifications. If you guys do want to support my channel, share my content. If you're interested, check out the merch. Uh, you're not going to force it to, but if you're interested in supporting me that way, feel free to. And uh, with that being said, I hope you guys all had a very blessed day and I will see you all in the next video.